The first suspect is a sex offender who failed to report a new address, according to authorities. His initial conviction was in Pennsylvania in the late 1980s. 61-year-old Harvey Lee Clemens, who was listed as a homeless person from Hickory, was arrested by Hickory police last Thursday for felony failure by a sex offender to report a new address. He is on the sex offender registry as the result of a 1987 conviction in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. The charges are not listed. Clemens was taken into custody without incident Thursday at an auto parts store on Highway 70 Southwest in Hickory. He was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $20,000 secured bond. He remained in jail as of earlier today. A court date was scheduled last Friday. 22-year-old Daniel Eugene Floyd Mathis of Pepe Street in Conover was arrested Saturday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. He's charged with kidnapping and simple assault. Mathis was detained in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $15,000 bond. A district court appearance was scheduled today. The next suspect faces drug theft and assault charges. 41-year-old Laurie Ann Hall of North Davis Avenue in Newton was arrested Friday by Newton police. She's charged with possession of methamphetamine, misdemeanor larceny, and simple assault. Hall was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $5,700 bond. District court dates were scheduled today and July 27th. 31-year-old Rachel Ann Farmer of Berkshire Drive in Newton was arrested Saturday by Newton police. She's charged with possession of methamphetamine, possession of drug paraphernalia, and driving while license revoked. Farmer was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility following the arrest under $2,500 bond. A district court appearance was scheduled today. Reporting from Catawba County for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood. Back to you.